This is one hell of a configuration. I don't think I've ever done this configuration. And that this can kind of show you. Fight! Hey, what is going on everyone? We're back at it with episode three of the Game and Chill series. I wanted to kind of come in today. There is a new update for Car Extreme Racing 2. As I said in the previous video, um, I was going to definitely experiment with all the new updates and uh, the new events. I think we also have an event starting and uh, so we're gonna come in and check that out. And yes, look at that. We get the uh, we get the links, the careless shirt, some gold, some silver, and other prizes, and even more, of course, with the pass. So we're gonna work on that afterward. What we're gonna do here is look at the new vehicles. We're gonna try to find those real quick. So we're looking here. I'm in tier one now. Hey, all right. Look at this. We have. I believe this is the old Torino. Yes, indeed. That is amazing. That's a beautiful car. And another one. Personally, I'm sorry. I don't know what this is, but this is gorgeous. I love it. New some new cars in here. Let's see here. We have those two new cars. And and an M2. Okay. All right. Three hundred and twenty-five gold though. That's gorgeous looking. Looks great. Modeling in this game is absolutely wonderful. Thank you for all the you know all the work that the developers put in for this. It's been some good stuff. Okay, and another Lexus. Okay. All right, getting the event as well. All right, looks like we're gonna have to do quite a bit of grinding for this event. It seems like we have three new cars, and we're gonna have to try to get them all. Is there any new spec cars? No. Okay. <laughs> All right, look at that, 75 gold, and these other two we get in the events. So we're gonna look over here at the events. Spring Aura, excuse me if I completely wrecked that name, but so, okay, so it's gonna be indeed a tier one through three available vehicles. Okay, so, oh man, this Parking and the next configuration is also it lets us know that's another part of the, uh, the update It's gonna let us know the next configuration and the amount of time So that gives you okay in the event just the same as multiplayer It gives you you know the time the, till the next track it lets you know also which track it is and how much time So we're definitely gonna try this track out. We're gonna We're gonna go for the FD though. I can't use the other cars. So <laughs> All right, let's give this a shot. What are we What are we working with here? Oh, okay, okay. Nice big, nice big open area here in Springstone. Okay, get up into fifth, get some extra gas. Uh, okay. This is one hell of a configuration. I don't think I've ever done this configuration. And that this can kind of show you. That was a lot of e-brake. All right, fourth gear, pull it through. This is not a very good line at all. I am just giving this a shot and hoping for the best. <laughs> oh, man. My in-game volume is quite loud. Okay. So, all right, so the task is a high speed changing five times. Okay, so we're gonna grind some of that real quick. All right, second run. Now I know where the hell I'm going. <laughs> Springstone is a beautiful track though. If, um, if I were to ever come here in real life and get to to do this track that'd be cool I, I don't you know i don't really do much in real life when it comes to that but you know when it comes to drifting and, and stuff like that or much of my life anyway but you know it's all right oh that was definitely <laughs> through the through the grass there uh try to get on the outside here a little more come on there we go there we go a little bit of angle 
swing it into the finish oh yeah okay all right so what i'm gonna do is i'm definitely gonna grind the crap out of this i'm gonna show you here and there of of some of my uh, my progress as i'm going through this uh we'll see what's up <laughs> uh definitely going to i'm gonna give a couple you know what let's try let's try this fc as well i'll show you the difference between the fc and the fd tune that i have right now this does not have the greatest tune on it yet so yeah it just automatically wants to like slip out um i have to figure out how i can make the oh just barely tap that a <laughs> little bit of a uh, little bit of side door damage um you got to figure out how i can make this not yeah that <laughs> uh, i i gotta figure out what's going on but there's this weird thing that like i do the same type of tune in a way that for some of my other cars and they don't work for you know other vehicles and you can't do that for all vehicles and that's good <laughs> but i definitely need to experiment more and and see what's going on with yeah i wanted to slip out there i had to definitely let go of the gas and i'm kind of just letting it swing into the finish i don't really care um man yeah it's okay so i have to do that a couple more times though so we are going to come back to this and double check some of the actually the body kits for the Lynx, the Hakasuka, the Siberia SWI, and the UDM3. So we're gonna not go to that. That's not, not the right one, my buddy. Uh, we're gonna go to Car Park. We're gonna look for the first one, the Lynx. It did indeed take me a second to remember which cars. I have not remembered all these cars at all. Um, so the Lynx, I do not have, but there is a new body kit for the RX-8. And then we also have a new body kit for the Hakasuka. Excuse me, I'm not the best at pronouncing or enunciating things. Um, so the Hakasuka also now has a new body kit. I do have this one, so we're going to check this out. Um, oh, okay. So we have here's the one I got. That's just the missile. Uh, CBW does look really clean, though. I do like that the the black, you know, flaring. Um, that was just some major flaring. I couldn't really do that with the tune that I have. And here's the new one. Okay, okay. You're looking almost looking like an El Camino. I like it. This this looks good. This looks really cool. That is, that is one heck of a, a little idea for it, but unfortunately, I think I am going to stick with my missile body kit here, so we're going to check out another one. And then we do indeed have a new body kit for the Siberia SWI, the WRX. Um, I unfortunately don't have this one either, so I can't show you. I'm very sorry, but this is another one that has a, a body kit, so look out for that. And then the last body kit they also put in was for the UDM3, the BMW. Uh, it looks like, unfortunately, I can't show you this one either. I do very much apologize. I would love to absolutely show you guys these, but um, look out for all the new three body kits that are in place. Um, go ahead and check, or excuse me, the four body kits that are all in place. And uh, I hope everyone enjoys the new ones. And let's get back to the digital dashboard modifications. That's what that'll be next. So I want to check that out. We're going to go here to body kits, go to parts, and we're going to look for dash. Okay, dashboard. Okay, so we have yellow, white, green. And those are, nope, those are the same. Yellow, white again. Okay, those are slightly different. Okay. You see the slight difference in the gauge there, our corp white red and blue so that's actually pretty cool it's only 700 credits it's really not much it's a cool little feature we get to add into the to the vehicle instead of it just being stock it'd be cool if it actually replaced the dashboard in a way but i'm glad that they only put it to where it stays original but it you know just puts in a little extra so that's pretty cool so definitely look out for that <laughs> okay so the next 
thing that we're going okay the next part of the update that we are going to look at here is the multiplayer aspect had gotten improved rival selection in multiplayer mode so we are going to look here in multiplayer and see how they set this up oh okay well thank you for letting me know i had gotten that like two days ago but i appreciate the <laughs> i appreciate you letting me know all that okay so it looks like so far the layout is indeed the same I don't see anything different other than I guess it's it's how everyone gets to their you know gets to the specific person I'm not getting to get full in detail into that because I'm not really big on the multiplayer anymore like I barely got to six now all I wanted was the Wellington to be honest so <laughs> But um, so yeah, definitely they improved the rival selection in multiplayer mode. So hopefully you don't get put up against someone who does just some random stuff. And so the next thing that they have put up here is the new thing of shortened countdown timer after pausing, which is wonderful because I felt like it was nice they put the timer in so you got some time to prepare for like getting back into your drift and everything. But the timer was just it just felt like it was so long if you were just already ready and it was just it was a little extra time so let's see all right so we're gonna check out this timer but i'm gonna throw down a little bit of a run here to kind of okay and yes there are definitely definitely something to look forward to or look out for is the fact that they're starting you in like first gear now instead of you know, like a possible third or a fourth gear already for you to start moving so that's that's a little bit of a weird update part that they put in but i'm gonna check out the the timer for this pause menu so okay so the pause menu is a little bit defined now uh the track is a little bit bigger on the right side here nothing major you get to see where exactly your, your clipping points in your wall taps and, and all that close to walls are so that's kind of nice so we're definitely going to check out this timer we're going to go continue and now they have ready go okay so they definitely took out the three two one it took a little bit just a little bit too long if you're already ready for the getting into your drift so look out for that so another new thing that they had added in was the fact that we get to paint specific parts now or some new parts it's, it says include customization options now include painting of some parts so we're gonna check that out so we're gonna paint here and we have body doors roof roll cage hood trunk yeah all the normal stuff windshield smoke arm okay, okay no coil spring caliper and ramp ah i don't know if that was i haven't checked that in a while so i'm not sure if that's new but i think windshield is definitely new okay so that's pretty cool so we get to tint our windows a little bit more now all right that's that's really cool stuff you know i'm gonna get that actually it's pretty good and we've made it to the end of this the last thing of this new update for car extract racing 2 is to the campaign apparently there is now a school available during drift campaign drift school so a new section because it was first corners and skill training first which no, I have not finished the skill training. I do indeed need to finish that, but I have been struggling because yay. Anyway, so drift school. Let's kind of check this out. Let's see what's going on here. So we have task one, do a drift score of 500. Okay, and it's not gonna, okay, so it is. Okay, so another drift score of 500, another 300, do a transition times one. Okay, so it's very, very basic stuff for, for all of the beginners, which is, that's great. That is good stuff. We also get some rewards for doing so. 1,000 silver, 3,000, 5,000, and 5 gold. So that's pretty cool. Thank you very much, you know, for, for in enabling that and getting some of the newer people that have no idea what they're doing to get up in here and be able to learn a little bit, a little bit slower. Because honestly, even, uh, even the first corners was kind of difficult for some people and and trying to get you know some of these tasks over here it you know when you're just starting out this is one hell of a thing to do so um that's great i'm really glad they put that in i hope that it helps some of the newer people understand you know a little bit further from you know the, the start there so that's really nice and uh, uh i hope to see more coming to this definitely more coming soon that's really awesome to see 
and I am going to double check. One also let you know the rewards, my bad. Uh, so the rewards here for the event. Um, there's some fuel, some gold, more fuel, the old school vinyl, which is awesome. I really need to freaking get that. Um, a new hat, uh, another new vinyl, some more gold, fans, gold, streets, more silver, more silver, gold, the careless shirt, a buffalo hat, another, um, like an anime vinyl, uh, uh oh, okay, some, um, some cherry blossoms, that's pretty cool, that's, that's pretty nice, uh, get the links at a thousand, though, where are you supposed to get these others in the event? What's up with these other cars? I'm assuming it's not in this event, actually, thinking about it. Okay, so the two new cars that said that they were supposed to be for in the event, which was this, this guy, excuse me, this guy get in the event, but I didn't see it in the event, so that makes me wonder. And then the second one, I believe, was this one. Yeah, the, the Lexus. So those two, you have to get in the event. And all right, well, I don't see it in the event, but we'll definitely see. I'll catch back on this, uh, you know, a little more info about the event and um, a little more grinding. Got to get to level 31 to get the Mustang and we are going to get back to you on that later i hope everyone's having a great day i really don't like this miata honestly i really need to change that it looks like crap uh i hope everyone's having a great day thank you very much for you know tuning in uh, i hope this helped in some way or let you know you know kind of what's happening within car street racing too take it easy be safe and um stay chilling have a good one. Thank you. Vibes on a track. Ooh.